You have lacked favor. Oh! Absolutely. Have you uh, emphasized the character and integrity and honesty in all that you've done? Yes, but you have not been fully understood. Neither have you been given the proper recognition for the course of your life and for the decisions that you have made that have pleased me to no end. You're my son. I'm your father. And I'm swelling. My uh, chest and heart are swelling with pride over what you've done for me. You've not just talked the talk. You've walked the walk. But there is a missing ingredient. You've had favor with me and virtually none with man. There has been an imbalance. And because of generational curses, you've not walked in the favor with man. As yeah. God said, I'm breaking off of you. Says the Lord, the word curses of your past, generations, generations, generations of unbelief and evil that has tormented you and tried to destroy your life and testimony, you have successfully stood against it, and yet you've been in a defensive posture. I want to break off of you every chronic spiritual problem that you cannot overcome. For there are some things you can overcome. There are other things that must be cast out. Therefore, by the finger of God, I cast out of you every word spoken against you and your family line. I cast out every assignment of the enemy. I cast out even those circumstances that you were victimized in and through. And now God says, raining down from the heavens now. Raining down from the heavens will come favor with man. There. Favor with man. Favor with man. Favor with man. Man, ever since I had hands laid on me, something came off of me. True. But now something's coming on you. Favor with man. God says, uh, even my son grew in it, and you need to as well. Grow in favor with man from this moment in time. This is a Kairos moment. This is a moment of, of departure for you from the old into the new. I've been talking to you. I've been stirring up something in you. You've been knowing it's a new season. You just didn't know what it was. This is that, says God, a new season where you will make your mark on the world. For you have been focused and devoted to the cause of Christ. But you have not had the right team around you. You have not had the right relational advantages. So now I'm going to be your man. I'm going to go before you. I will be the one that books you and schedules you and connects you. And you're going to be overwhelmed by the connections I'm going to arrange for you. For you will make your mark in this generation of believers, says the Lord. You have lacked favor. Oh! 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 Take video. Oh. So they need to trade. Oh.